Why do my wife keep cheating, and what can I do? Coping. Hello all, the infidelity keeps happening and happening and being downplayed. My wife is out of town every weekend, and she dumps the kids on the family to either go out of town to cheat or bring men over to our house to cheat. This week, my wife disabled the home security cameras to sneak a man into our house after the kids went to bed, so that she could talk and have dinner with him. She got caught when they were talking in the kitchen and woke our kids up. He lied to her about his name and that he is married and has kids of his own, and she is still talking to him because they are just friends. The phone records show them talking and texting a lot. This is at least the third different guy this has happened with. She had made a dating app profile saying she was separated and wants to date but nothing serious and put it as her headline, only friends, no BS. My wife promised me while we were working on our marriage that she wouldn't keep cheating or make a dating app profile. She told me she's getting all the kids to go to her family tonight so she can finally get some rest. I'm pretty sure she is having the same guy come over. Her burner phone rang while I was video chatting with her earlier, and she rejected the call quickly and turned white. I called her out on it, and she said oh, I am just charging it because its battery is low, but she doesn't use the burner phone. Why is the battery low, or does it needs to be charged if you don't use it? Yes, I know what's going on. She promises me she is no longer cheating, but I think we all know the truth. Would you have any ideas on what to do or how to get my wife to stop cheating? She said she would like to call again tonight after the kids leave so we can discuss how to keep improving our communication and trust and work out our stuff, but she also wants to get some rest since the kids will be gone. Update As I suspected, she temporarily snoozed the security cameras to keep from recording him coming into the house. Still, I logged onto the app about 25 seconds in time, to hit manually record and got a video of him walking in. I confronted her over the phone and asked him to leave, he told me he wasn't trying to do anything and that he just liked my wife because she was down to earth and honest, blah blah blah. I heard it all before from the last guy she snuck into our home. Redditor's Comments Redditor 1 So how many times will it take to catch her before you end it? How often does she have to show you disrespect before you finish it? How many false reconciliations will it take before you have enough? These are the questions you need to answer for yourself. If you are past that number, then end it. She will not stop. OP follow-up. I do not see how this can continue to go on for very much longer. My limit has already been reached. I told my wife I had reached my limit when she threatened to get a restraining order on me, and if she did it again, I was done. That was the fourth time she threatened to ruin me and falsely accuse me of abuse to get a restraining order. She got distraught when I had my family take all my weapons out of our safe while she was on the road, cheating out of town. Redditor 2 Carry a voice-activated recorder at all times to protect yourself against false charges. Redditor 3. I'm sorry, but from your post, I would say you haven't reached your limit. I did the same thing, so this isn't meant to belittle you. I recognize it because it was my behavior for several years, one of my life's biggest regrets, if not the biggest. OP follow-up. I have reached my limits. I want to know how to deal with the hurt and pain of being lied to repeatedly. I'm dealing with it for a specific reason that will not be discussed on an open forum online. Redditor 4. I'll give you some quick advice. Do the 180 on her. Go cold and indifferent to her or anything she says that isn't about the kids or bills. Could you gather solid proof of what is happening and print it out? See a lawyer immediately and have them draw up divorce papers. See if written statements from the people she dumps the kids on so she can cheat will help in custody. Please take a copy of your evidence and put it in the divorce papers along with your ring. Do it when you are leaving for work, 
and ignore all of her texts and calls. Please don't open any of the messages. When you go home, she will probably put on a show with tears, and a speech about this isn't what she wants, and you'll get the old story of how sorry she is and wants to work it out. Explain very coldly that she has had plenty of opportunities to work things out and that her wants are no longer your concerns. Your wife can feel free to take them up with whoever she has over or meets with when you leave the house. Spend more time with the kids doing activities she isn't invited to. Teach them lessons on honesty, morals, and ethics. Sometimes let her hear you discussing how important these are for people to be good people and successful in all aspects of life. Set back and watch the implosion she has. After that, the next move is yours, but I'd plan on sticking with divorce because someone this deep into cheating can never stop. OP follow-up. Thank you. I have been a gray rock for the last three weeks, and all I hear about is how I don't love her anymore and how I am so horrible to her and emotionally checked out, partially true, it still hurts like crap when she cheats. Some of the things you've suggested have been performed. I have difficulty coping in the interim, waiting for something to play out. I feel I've been lied to for years and have been used, gaslighted, manipulated, and abandoned. I don't see those feelings going away for the next few months. I have gotten a therapist to help me, but the emotions are very vivid in my mind often. The continual lies when I know what's going on while the family is waiting just hurt. Redditor 5. WTF? Could you let me know why you're even here? Dump her sorry ass. Pack her shit and send it all to his home with a note that he has won the booby prize. OP follow up. What is a booby prize? Redditor 5 follow up. Last place, in other words, he loses the game but wins your ex. I learned a new word today, booby prize. OP is waiting on his wife to change, and his wife sees a pushover who she can treat anyway. What would you do if you were in OP's shoes? Please comment below, and I will see you in the following story. Please feel free to like and subscribe.